Hello guys, welcome to Bike Geek. In today's video, I will guide you how to access your Windows desktop from another room in your house. Instead of walking there, you can remotely control it using your Android phone or tablet. Remote desktop is a handy feature that lets you access your computer from anywhere within your network. In this tutorial, I'll guide you step by step on how to enable and use remote desktop effectively. Let's dive in. First, you need to ensure that Remote Desktop is enabled on the computer you want to access. Go to Windows Settings, click on the Start menu and then the gear icon to open Settings. In the System tab, locate and click on Remote Desktop in the left hand menu. You'll see a toggle for Enable Remote Desktop. Turn it on. A pop-up will appear asking you to confirm your action. Click Confirm to proceed. Then in Remote Desktop Users, click on this option and add Who can access your laptop. Click on Add button. New window will open. Click on Advanced option. Then click on Find Now button. Now in the search result, find Everyone option. Click on Everyone and then click OK. Before connecting remotely, you must know your laptop username and password. If you use a Microsoft account to log in to your PC, your username is your email and the password is your Microsoft account password. If you use a local account, remember the username and password you set up. Now next step is you must know your local IP address of your laptop or PC. Open the command prompt by typing CMD in the start menu search bar and pressing enter. In the command prompt window, type ipconfig and press enter. Scroll through the results until you find your IPv4 address under your active network connection. Write it down as this is what you'll use to connect to your PC. Now we will set up our mobile phone to access this laptop from our device. To access your PC from your phone or tablet, you'll need the Microsoft Remote Desktop app. On your Android device, open the Play Store and search for Microsoft Remote Desktop. Install the app by tapping the Install button. While the app is downloading, make sure your Android device is connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your Windows PC. This is essential for the connection to work. Once the app is installed, it's time to configure it to connect to your computer. Open the Remote Desktop app. Tap on Accept button. Now we will add the computer. Tap the plus icon at the bottom corner to add a new connection. Then tap on Add PC option. This app will detect our local network remote computers, but we will add manually to add the computer. Enter the local IP address of your PC in the PC name field. Tap on Add User Account and enter the Windows username and password you noted earlier. In the Friendly Name field, type a name that makes it easy to identify your PC. This name will help if you plan to add multiple devices in the future. Hit Save to complete the setup. Now that everything is set up, it's time to connect to your PC. In the Remote Desktop app, you'll see the connection you just created. Tap on it to start a session. If you see certification error, don't worry, just tap on Never Ask Again and tap the Connect button. The app will load your Windows desktop on your Android screen. You're now in full control of your computer or laptop. While controlling your PC from an Android device is convenient, it's not always the most user-friendly experience due to the smaller screen and touch controls. Use this feature for quick tasks or emergencies when you can't reach your PC physically. That's it for this tutorial. If you found this helpful, please like, share and comment below. Let me know how you plan to use remote desktop or share your own tips and experiences. See you in the next video.